Renowned for its unique blend of architecture and cultural landmarks, Vienna is among Europe's top travel destinations. But while it's perhaps best known for its heritage buildings, the capital of Austria has been pioneering new approaches to urban living for years. Now it's innovating again as it looks to solve its growing population problem while cementing its status as one of the world's most livable cities. Combining the power of technology, sustainable design and modern methods of construction, this is how Vienna is tackling one of the continent's biggest construction projects, an entire new city within a city. Vienna is one of the fastest growing major cities in the European Union. The Austrian capital has been expanding since the late 1980s, but the growth rate began to increase substantially once the country joined the EU in 1995. Positioned between the regions of Central and Eastern Europe, Vienna has consistently adapted to increasing numbers of people, regularly developing new initiatives to urban development. But when it became clear that the city's population was set to pass 2 million by 2027, creating demand for housing, jobs, public spaces and transport that it would struggle to meet, the city began embarking on one of the continent's largest urban expansion projects. Aspern Seestadt is an entire new quarter of the city spread across 240 hectares built on the site of a former airfield. Far from being just a way to accommodate new citizens, the scheme is seen as an opportunity to integrate innovative new ideas and concepts, improve the city's already high quality of life and lower its carbon footprint. Including over 11,000 high quality new homes, the potential for 20,000 workplaces and numerous smart city initiatives, total investment in the new quarter is expected to reach around 6 billion US dollars once complete. Work on the project's actually been underway since 2009, and by mid-2020, around a third of the site area had been developed. The district's already home to about 8,500 residents and some 300 businesses. Aspen Seestadt translates to urban lakeside, and at the heart of the community is a massive artificial lake that required the excavation of 650,000 tonnes of earth. Once removed, that material was processed at a centre on the site before being recycled to build new structures elsewhere in the district. Concrete from the old runways has also been dug up and reused to create roads and thoroughfares. But the intelligent use of materials Aspen Seestadt goes far beyond heavy recycling. The development's also home to Ho Ho Veen, the world's second tallest timber building, standing 84 metres high and dominating the skyline of the lakeside business area. Containing a hotel, apartments, restaurants and offices, over 75% of the structure is made from sustainably sourced wood that's native to Austria. Timber construction can be seen across other parts of the site too. In the southeastern section, a complex of more than 200 homes has been built, with timber used for the walls and facades as well as in community areas. A large number of building elements here at Ho Ho Veen and on buildings all over Aspen Seestadt were prefabricated under factory conditions. That's significantly sped up the build process, cut waste, helped to improve quality and reduced disruption to nearby residents and businesses. The use of pre-cast concrete, where components like walls, slabs and beams are all made off-site in specialised automated production facilities before being trucked in and craned into place, is extensive on this project. Over on the western edge of the new quarter, a cluster of housing blocks designed and built by Mishek Systembau, a subsidiary of Strabag, has been constructed using pre-cast techniques. Being able to build at speed while ensuring errors were prevented was a key requirement for Mishek, and digital tools from Allplan helped the firm achieve this goal. With its precast competence sensor, Allplan provides a range of software dedicated to prefabrication. The company's Planbar 3D modeling tool allowed Mishek to carry out the precast detailing and preparation work with extra precision. Using Planbar, architectural models can be imported and optimized while shop drawings are generated automatically and update themselves whenever the model changes. Allplan's work preparation tool, TIM, is then used for quality control, ensuring all data relating to production, assembly and logistics is error-free, 
before manufacturing begins. Technology at Aspen Seestadt isn't just limited to the way its buildings are designed and constructed. A number of the houses and other buildings have been equipped with smart tech, creating highly efficient homes for residents and test beds for new research. Data from these buildings is fed into an on-site urban lab which has been operating since 2013 with the aim of optimising energy production and consumption as well as developing smart power grids. Although work on the new district isn't expected to fully complete until the 2030s, the development is already a fully functioning quarter. As well as several clusters of homes and offices, there are numerous shops, service providers, schools and even high-tech production and R&D facilities on the site. Many of the key transport links and mobility initiatives are also now up and running. New rail links, a combined train metro station and another metro stop, connect the district to the centre of Vienna and Bratislava in neighbouring Slovakia. Two new tram links are also planned. In total, a fantastic 80% of travelling will be done via walking, cycling or public transport. For a work in progress, Aspen Seestadt has left many impressed with what it's achieved so far. It's won multiple awards for smart initiatives and property management before it's even reached its halfway point, and that's proof that the project's made a big early impression. With rising urban populations, the climate emergency and improving well-being on the list of challenges for many of our urban centres, Vienna is setting a new standard for expansion that cities across Europe, if not the world, may soon look to follow. This video was made possible by Allplan and you can learn more about how their software is digitising the world of precast concrete at the link below. And as always, if you enjoyed this video and you want to get more from the definitive video channel for construction, make sure you're subscribed to the B1M.